Today, I want to quickly talk to you about something called micro adjustments and something that you may not kind of know. Now, believe it or not, it's easier to shoot a target that is moving than it is to shoot one that is standing still. Not only that, it is easier to control your recoil when you are moving rather than just standing still. Usually with a wingman, you're not just going to follow and track your target with your right stick because that's not going to lead to 100% accuracy, especially when you're on a controller. You can't do the finest adjustments, especially at like long range. So you're going to do something called micro adjustments, which is where you use your left stick to move and make those little tiny kind of movements, <laughs> mini movements, you know, mini movements, micro movements. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you don't even need to use your right stick to aim. Now you may say, oh, I already knew about this, but how many of you actually use this? Hello. And if you're trying to track a target at distance, move the same way the target is moving and it will literally be so much easier for you to control recoil. I will show you an example using the target at the very back there instead of this one, because this one's a little bit too close. So you shouldn't be using an R9 at this range, but this is just to show you what I mean. Not terrible. Now moving. I'll do it again while moving. Then I'll do it while standing still one more time. And if you're like, Koala Bean, what am I actually going to do to be able to increase my skill in micro adjustments? Well, very, very simply. You go in the range, you pick up a wingman, okay? And you have to hit headshot on every single one of these targets, that dummy and these targets, and just keep doing that until you're hitting 100% headshots, basically. So yeah, guys, I hope you found this a little bit helpful, and make sure to just move with your target when you are shooting them.